Hi, this is Brian Stark, and I'm going to show you how to add a purchase for materials. To do this, you want to navigate to the Inputs and Materials area, and then choose either Chemicals, Fertilizer, Lime, or Seeds from above. Now, in this example, we're going to choose Chemicals. We've got a Roundup Ultramax here, and I want to do a purchase for that. Now, what you want to do is go to the three dots next to the Edit button, and choose New Purchase. Here we can choose the date of the purchase, I can add the quantity purchased and the unit cost per gallon in this case. Now $25 was probably there when I initially set up the material and I'm going to choose 28 this time. Um, tax can be entered in and then I got my total cost. Now the checkbox underneath that update material and tax for 2019. Now basically if I check that box it will use this information for all those field activities that have been done prior to this. So that's a great way of updating all those at one time. Now, the detail down below, the vendor and invoice number, uh, completely optional, but this is how I can track that as well. And everything looks great, and I'll hit the OK button. And now my purchase appears. And a few things here to point out, here's your purchase and your running inventory balance. Now, the software has the ability to do some filtering. So up above, you can choose just purchases, and it would show all the purchases of that material. Also, you have a way of seeing the usage of that material. Now, in my example, I don't have any fields that I've used that material on, which is why it's blank here. But what's really nice about this is the ability to see both purchases and usage on one screen. And at the end of the day, you want to see a running balance of inventory, and this is exactly what that feature will do for you. If you make any mistakes, um, no problem, just hit the edit button and you're right back to that purchase where you can make that change. Well, thanks again for watching the video. Keep an eye open for additional videos in the future.